Someone on this page with lung problems. Where are you? Someone on this page with lung problems. Rebecca Murray. God knows your name. What's the problem, Rebecca? Yeah. Well, um, I have something with my lungs where it's hard for me to breathe when I go up the stairs or uphill. And I um I That's the power of God going into your lungs, Rebecca. That's the power of God. And Ashley is feeling that power going into her lungs. Something's happening mm -hmm. here. Ashley's feeling the power of God in her lungs as you're being healed. Yeah. That's the power of God on your lungs, Rebecca. Power of God's nice. moving on your lungs, on your lungs. That's your lungs being healed. Take a deep breath. Lungs are being healed. It's your lungs. Oh, they're good now. They're good now. Lift your hands and thank Jesus okay. for your healing, Rebecca. Thank you, Jesus, for my healing. So why don't you step back from your cam from your camera, about six feet back from your camera, and just try running on the spot. That should uh, give you your lungs a workout. <laughs> okay. Can you run faster? Um... There you go. Ashley, this is Holy Spirit Reality TV. Yes. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> okay, how is that, Rebecca? Um, pretty good. It's pretty good. Um I'm feeling like a little winded, but not like I normally would. Not like you normally would. Well, Ashley's gonna pray some more for you, okay? All right. Okay. Thank you, Jesus, for 100% restoration of her lung capacity. We thank you, Jesus, 100% healing. In the name of Jesus, amen. 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 So just lift your hands. Thank Jesus for your complete healing. Thank you, Jesus, for my complete healing. Thank you, okay, go and do some more running. <laughs> <laughs> You know, when you pray for people, you have to persevere. Don't give up. Even Jesus prayed twice for the blind man. Yeah. Give it a good workout, Rebecca. She'll be in the gym before she knows it. Okay, how is that going, Rebecca? Um, that was better. That was even better. That was even better. Um, yeah. You can see the redness in your face where the oxygen's flowing through your blood. What was the problem with your lungs? Um, like I, I would read to my, I would attempt, like I would read the Bible to my son, and I would gasp for air in between words, and I would go up the stairs, and I would feel like, like my my breathing would become so heavy. I'd feel like, oh my goodness, like am I gonna die like this? And then, um, but a few weeks later, I noticed a more significant change in my lungs and they're much better um, than they were. So please use us. <laughs> Praise the Lord. So what happened in meeting 32 when we were prayed for? What did you feel happen? I just a little bit. I just noticed a little change at first. And then mm -hmm. after a few weeks went by, I noticed a bigger change. And I was like, wow, praise God. And, um, and Rebecca, that's the power of God going through you from your head down through, through you. That's the power of God going through you. Not only uh, this is a power that's changing your life, but changing your circumstances, changing you uh, because you will be transformed from glory to glory by the power of the Holy Spirit. There's uh, your personality is under the power of God right now, Rebecca, in Jesus' mighty name. I seeing a like a wind whirling down through you. It's the power of Jesus Christ, like a wind going through you. Thank you, Lord. We give you all the glory and all the honor. Thank you, Lord, because you used to kind of cave in on yourself when problems happened. You kind of cave in on yourself, and now you're going to be like Eric, aggressively outgoing in love. When things go wrong, it won't matter. You're still at it. That's the power of God bringing that about in your life. Thank you, Lord. We'll leave you under the power of God, Rebecca. We praise God. 